New details in the case of a woman whose body was found in a Staten Island Park last month. The medical examiner's office now says her death was a homicide. CBS New York's Nick Calloway spoke to her family and has the latest. 25-year-old Ola Salem's death was ruled homicide by asphyxiation, according to findings just released by the medical examiner. Her body was found October 24th in a wooded area of Bloomingdale Park on Staten Island. No arrests have been made in the case. On the other side of Staten Island, outside Salem's family home in the Shore Acres neighborhood, her mother had no comment. Salem's brother only saying his sister's death has been incredibly hard on the family. I've seen a lot of commotion. Emmanuel Triarzi owns a house across the street. He said he saw and heard two men and a woman arguing in front of Salem's home on Deal Court a couple of weeks before her death. There were two men. One was really getting a little violent, I thought, a little, and uh, the other one had put a stop to, to his violence or his anger. Other neighbors remember seeing police cars in front of the house multiple times in the last year. Does this surprise you? Very, very much. It scares me a lot now. Araminta Williams walks past the family home every day. She says the news of the young woman's death is terrifying. It's sad. It's very, very sad. Sources say shortly after Salem's death, her father fled to Egypt. That raised red flags with investigators. There is also a history of domestic violence between Salem and her ex-husband. But police say the investigation into her death remains ongoing. Prior to her death, Salem volunteered at a women's center advocating for women who were victims of domestic violence. In the Shore Acres neighborhood of Staten Island, Nick Calloway, CBS in New York.